Listen to this. Trinity Health of New England will be one of a few healthcare organizations in the entire country authorized to test a new possible treatment for COVID-19. Yeah, that's some good news. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Elliot Polikoff is live in Hartford with more on how this treatment might work. Elliot, good morning to you. Good morning, guys. Yeah, Irene and Nicole, I'm at St. Francis Hospital in Hartford, and you can already see behind me some cars lining up for that drive through COVID-19 testing. And check out the line here on Asylum Street. It just keeps going and going as far as the eye can see. These drive through testing sites so important to fighting the coronavirus, but that's only the tip of the iceberg when it comes to what St. Francis and Trinity Health are doing to fight this COVID-19 pandemic. The healthcare network set to begin testing the use of plasma from those who have recovered from COVID-19 as a possible treatment. And here's how it works. Patients that have recovered from COVID-19, they will give blood, the plasma will be removed and given to sick patients. And the hope is that the antibodies built up against the coronavirus from those who have already recovered will help others still fighting the disease. These are very critically ill patients. So I think the benefit, it's clear that the benefit outweighs the risk. And that's why we think that it aligns with our mission at Trinity of New England. This trial has already been approved by the FDA. The use of plasma has been successfully used in the past to battle SARS and H1N1. And if it ends up working here and there's already been positive results elsewhere in the world, then Trinity Health, they can use this at all of their hospitals, not just at St. Francis here in Hartford. Of course, we'll be sure to update you on any new developments regarding this potential cure for the coronavirus. But for now, in Hartford, Ellie Polikoff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.